So what I'm gonna talk about today is how we can um, harvest what we have in our garden and then um, make medicine from that. You know, we just have a couple months where we could really harvest a lot of, a lot of things. And so learning how to preserve it is really important. One of the simplest ways is drying. You want to have the, um, the stems clean of any leaves. Because if there's a bunch of leaves here and you tie, tie it, you're, you could get mold. Bunch it together and make a, a nice sized bunch, but you don't want it to be too big because it needs ventilation. And hang it in a place that is shady, that's dry, and, um, and that has good ventilation. You want to dry it as, as quickly as you can, but make sure that it's dry right? Because if you put it away and it's a little wet, it could go moldy. So make sure it's, it's totally dry. And then um, what I do is put it in a mason jar and then store it in the pantry or any cool, um, dry, dark place, right? Bug bites have venom. You're going to have a bit of inflammation and a histamine reaction. You want to draw out that venom. Anything you want to draw out, plantain is amazing at doing that, a stringing and drawing agent. You know, as much as possible, breaking down the cell wall, so what I'll do is I'll just chop it up with a knife first, and then you just mash it. Yeah, so you just smash it up so then it's kind of like a, a sludge, just, um, just green mash. You could do the same thing with yarrow, but that poultice is used to stop bleeding. And then we have comfrey, which is amazing for cell regeneration.